Hey everyone, welcome back to Figma Fusion Studio. Today, we're diving into the next section of the button component. If you haven't watched the first section yet, I highly recommend checking that out first. You can find the link in the description or click on the link appearing at the top right of your screen. Let's get started! In the last section, we created a simple button and added dynamic icon control along with visibility control for the icon. Now, we need to add an icon on the left side. Let's see how we can achieve this using the second method. Copy all the icons we created earlier, then right-click and select Detach Instant. Now, they are detached from their components. Next, go to the Create Component section, click on the down arrow, and select Create Component Set. Now, you'll see that all the icons are grouped with a purple outline. Renaming the component to Icon. Copy one icon from the component set and paste it into our button. Now the icon is pasted at the center, but we need it on the left side. Use the shortcut to move the icon to the left side. Next, we need to add visibility control. To do that, select the icon, go to the appearance section in the right side panel, click on the variable property icon, and then click the plus icon in the small pop-up. Create a new property, name it left icon, set the default value to true, and click create property. Here, we can also see the right icon property that we created earlier. Now, we have separate controls for both left and right icons, allowing us to toggle their visibility independently. Now, go to the artboard and test how the icon visibility control is working. Toggle the property to see if the icon appears and disappears as expected. Then, we need to add icon dynamically change control for the left icon. To do that, select the left icon, go to the right side properties panel, and click on the Apply Instance Swap Properties icon and select Create Property. Name it a left icon swap. Now go to the artboard and check how it works. You should see a new control that allows you to swap the left icon dynamically. Click on the left icon swap control. In method one, you could see all the icons directly, but in this method, you need to navigate into the component. We named it icon, so click on icon, and now you can see all the available icons. Select any icon, and it will update in the button accordingly. Another way is to click on the left icon, and now you will see a drop-down with the component name in the right side panel. From here, you can also change the icon easily. Now, we need to copy and paste the left icon into all variants to maintain consistency across different button states. Go to the artboard, and now all variants have both left and right icons with control. If the icon's visibility is hidden, the swap option drop-down will also be hidden. We'll stop here for this video. In the next one, I'll show you how to add size properties, create another button state like size, type, outline button, button, or even design an icon only button. If we add all of that here, the video length will increase. Stay tuned for the next lesson. Like and subscribe, and if you have any doubts related to Figma, drop a comment, I'll cover it in an upcoming lesson. Keep designing, 